all right everyone hello and welcome back to the channel all right now so here's a video that my good friend Henneman sent me in Henneman thank you for the video my friend now the video deals with a fraud editor who calls himself New York State Audits aka Daniel Castillo now uh, let's just say that I've done more than a handful of videos on Daniel whereas uh, uh, let's just say Daniel doesn't have a vehicle uh, so Daniel does his fraud it's in the neighborhood where he lives at and Daniel doesn't just fraud it law enforcement officers he also fraud it's the general public anybody that he can pretty much get a rise out of okay uh, that's the a-ho uh, the type of a-ho that he is now again I say uh, he truly has a hard on with uh, law enforcement officers whereas uh, I've done a bunch of videos where uh, any encounter he has with law enforcement uh, he pretty much talks to them like they're pieces of shit and I think it's safe to say guys whether you uh, work for the government or you're just the average public citizen hey Nobody wants to be spoken to like a piece of shit. And let's just say that uh, Daniel and others who uh, call themselves freedom fighters or, or their constitution, whatever the hell they want to call themselves, they truly feel that the Constitution allows them to talk to people like shit. Okay? And again, let me point out that one of, my, uh, uh, one of the subjects that I want to bring up in my live stream later on is that this, uh, again, this so-called movement they're not just going after government employees, law enforcement officers. They're going after us, the general public. Okay. Now, I've uh, my last video that I did of Daniel. Daniel had the audacity to uh, record a uh, dead body, a dead body. Now, okay. And when the officers that were uh, uh, closing off the scene, however you want to call it, uh, one of the officers had mentioned, "Hey, Danny, you're not breaking the law." But morals, have some morals where, uh, how would you like uh, you being a, uh, watching YouTube and the next thing you see is your family member dead on the ground on a YouTube video, okay? Normally, journalists, as they like to call themselves, journalists wait until the family of the dead has been uh, notified and then they put their stories out. But that's not the way these assholes work. These assholes, again, I say, they truly feel that the Constitution allows them to do whatever the hell they want, however they want. They totally uh, traded in their uh, consideration for their fellow citizen uh, for the almighty YouTube money and fame. Okay? Now, there's a lot more that I like to say, but as we all know, a lot of you feel that I talk too much and more video, less talk, and all this other BS. So, Let's get into the video. I want to give you an example, and I want to give you an example of how he treats police, uh, because uh, uh, the video that I wanted, uh, that Henneman sent me, I want to point something out that I truly find very funny. But let me show you an example of how he treats police just because they're police. How's it going, man? How you doing? You on a call? You on a call by any chance? Just curious. But chand, right? Something like that? You wanna have a conversation with me, man? I'm just investigating right now. I'm doing a story. You on call by any chance? What he's looking at? I don't know. Let's see what he's looking at. Yo, don't put your fucking hands on me. 
back. Don't put your hands on me, bro. It's my car. Don't put your hands on me. You keep putting your hands on me, I'm going to push you away. Just like I'm doing. I have a right to go by the car. It's not yours. It's a taxpayer car. You're damn right. Call your sergeant. Call your sergeant. They're busy? You just use excessive force. So I'm going to go buy our vehicle. Right. You, if you vehicle. keep, is it your vehicle? Is it your vehicle? You, you own this? You own this vehicle? You fucked up when you put your hands on me, bro. That's where you fucked up. Yeah. I have a right to go buy our vehicle. You have no right to put your hands on me. Look, at you worried about space, right? Back the fuck up, homie. Back up. Get out of my face. You just came up to me. Back the fuck up. Back up. Next to this How are you going to say, to I have a fucking right you to investigate. Here, no, fuck you. You just step put your hands here. on me. Back up. Step and then you were talking about get out of your face when you keep invading my here. personal space. You're invading my personal By space. By walking over here? Yes, you are. Fuck you. Yes, you You're are. A liar. Yes, you are. And that's are. why it's all live. Okay. Live, bitch. Okay. You can live. record all you want. I'm recording. Live. live. It doesn't matter. Are you? Yeah. Good. Oh, yeah. Good. Because I'm a fucking foyer request that. Fuck you. Nope. Get away from my car. No, it's not your car. Who's car is it? Taxpayers. Yep. We the people. I do. I came over here chill, asking you shit, and you want to put your fucking hands on me like a bitch. Do it again, see what happens. That's why every time you put your hands on me, what I do, I slap that shit away, right? Yeah, and you ain't do nothing, right? Because you a fucking bitch, and you know you fucked up. Fuck out of here. Fucking clown. Look at this fucking clown. Fuck out of here. Bag 19. Go ahead. What's up? Let me see it. Let me see it. Don't hide it. Live, yo. Live. Excuse me. What you farted? What you farted? Excuse you. Fuck. All right, so there you go. Now, this video is just an example of how Danny works, okay? As we noticed, Danny, out of nowhere, happened to see this officer hanging out in the uh, in the parking lot there. And Danny is now bent on uh, getting a video. He's going to give his subscribers some uh, uh, something to watch, okay? Uh, because he knows the majority of his uh, subscribers, they hate law enforcement too, okay? And so he can make a video of showing hatred towards an officer, abuse of an officer let's say and make a buck at the same time and you notice that the officer there well didn't want to get into a back and forth argument with the a-hole here but as we all know an individual who's intent on making a video will do whatever they have to do to get that person to react now the kick in the ass is is that that officer did react once uh, Danny boy want to play that bullshit of recording inside the vehicle deal okay uh, come on now I think it's safe to say no Nobody, whether it be a police officer or not, nobody uh, would go for that shit of you recording inside of their vehicle. Danny and others are uh, assholes like good guy audits and other knuckleheads who use this tactic to get into a back and forth argument with police. Come on now. They wouldn't even appreciate it if they had a vehicle, which neither one of them has a vehicle. But, okay, uh, this bullshit about it's the taxpayer's vehicle and all. Granted, money, uh, tax money was spent on these vehicles once it's given to the department as a tool for them to use that's their vehicle that's the way i see it now again i put this video to give you an example of uh, how danny interacts with police in his neighborhood okay every officer in that department schenectady uh schenectady new york uh, police department are fully aware of this asshole they try to stay away from this asshole they don't want to have shit to do with this asshole now can you imagine living in a neighborhood where uh, your own local police department don't want to have shit to do with you and god forbid that day that you need them like in the next video they need them he needed them hey they're not gonna do shit for you because of all the shit you've done for them let's get into the next video and i'll show you why i put this video up and uh you understand a little better danny's a big a-hole big time What's going on? If you're just tuning in, I don't even know what's going on. But it uh, looks like we got ambulance. Dang, I can't even read that. So I can't even tell what it says. But we got three. Schenectady police vehicles over here. 
Let me see. I guess a woman got hit in her head. Caller was yelling, get away from me. Get away from me. They heard male and female voices. So that's what's going on right now. I couldn't show you, but I was able to read it. So I'm walking down Albany Street, because that's where we're at. And I saw three police vehicles. So I figured I'd go live so I could see what's good with you guys. So what's going on? What's good, everybody? Everybody that's tuning in. Yeah, I can't even uh I can't even turn it sideways, Brooklyn audit. I wish I could. I will show you how it looks, but I'm telling you, <laughs> it ain't gonna work. Yo, well let's try it, let's try it. I'm gonna show you. See what I mean? I can't do it. We gotta work with what we got, kid, you know. Take off the lock, it's a circle with an arrow. I don't think I have those capabilities like you, player. So hopefully she's all right. No, I appreciate it, man. Trust me, when I first did, I don't do lives like you do, but when I did my first, or I believe my second, I was trying to flip it sideways quick. But you know, man, we work with what we got for the time being. Well, from what I looked at the uh, on the computer in the cop car, uh, I believe uh, she was struck or something like that. From what it, from what the what is it, the dispatch notes? But it's kind of quiet out here tonight. I ain't gonna front. Why is you taping? Take that off. Don't take it. Don't take it. Don't take it. I don't know what, what you're doing. Why would you be taking it? Yes, I do, because that's my mother. Who are you? That's my mom, bro. Beat it. Excuse me. Beat it. It ain't no beat it. Beat it. No. All right. So let me pause the video here, whereas I think we could all understand why the daughter and the son uh, just don't want this shit going on social media. OK, this is a personal incident. This has nothing to do with cop watching. OK, you will hear him after he gets into the little scuffle here. You will hear him tell his subscribers uh, all the little bullshit about that. He was about to leave. He was about to when uh, he noticed the daughter and the son come at him. Uh, he 
was going to leave. Well, he turned around and says that he's going to move. And, and so you'll hear the bullshit in a little bit. But come on, all the frauders say the same bullshit. The minute the cuffs come out, I was just about to leave. Yeah, right. Okay. So again, I say, uh, if you got to watch my video where he recorded the dead body, come on, right there. He doesn't have respect for nobody. So, again, I think we could all understand why the daughter and the son were a little upset about some asshole that they don't know recording uh, what's going on there. Okay? And then, after the little scuffle, uh, listen, he's going to get bent out of shape because the police didn't do shit to help him out. How many times have you heard these frauders uh, tell the police, hey, oh, the Supreme Court has ruled that you are, you don't have shit to do with my safety. Now, when shit happens and the police don't do shit, now all of a sudden they're crying victim. The police didn't do a damn thing. And let me tell you that I cut the video down, okay? Uh, you just, right after the scuffle, I end the video, but uh, the whole video at the end of him going to the police department so that he could file complaints on every officer that was there <laughs> because they didn't save his ass from, uh, uh, from the two individuals here who attacked him, okay? Hey. He opened the door to this shit. He got what he wanted. And let me just say, reading the comments on his videos was crazy. So I will put a link to this video as well. And I'm truly hoping that you guys make a visit and give him some of your input. Redress your frauditor. Let me know your thoughts on the video, guys. And I will see you in my next one. Yo, can you stop touching me, please? Can you try to break your phone and I don't get Yo, dude. Yo, they're fucking attacking me in front of y'all. Yeah, so what? Yeah, we like that. Dude, what the fuck? They're attacking me in front of you. I want to press charges. I want to press charges. I want to press charges. That's it, man. What the fuck? Yo, dude. Dude, back up. Back the fuck up. Back the fuck up, man. I'm not looking for problems. I'm not looking for problems. What the hell, man? I'm pressing charges, man. I'm pressing officer. I'm pressing charges. Yo, it's crazy, man. It's crazy. Excuse me, miss. Miss, can I get your name? Can I get your name, please? Can I? Can I get your name, please? You was assaulted. You can be assaulted. You don't need a name. On the wall. Whatever you say, killer. Whatever you say. <laughs> Yo, you see that shit? You see they was putting hands on me in front of them and these motherfuckers didn't do shit. We about to find out. Excuse me. How are you? I'm alright, tired, man. Midnight. Well, you here for me now. Yeah. How's it going? I'm gonna need everybody's names and badge numbers too before we go. They'll let you know that it's all good. That's not, what's that mean? Okay, well, guess what? That's additional charges. You don't make no sense right now. Is it? Okay, that's good. Well, you're going to jail tonight. Damn, yo, this is fucking crazy. Crazy, man. Threatening, yo, they threatened me in front of them. Crazy, man. Y'all saw me, I was far. I kept my distance, I was on the sidewalk. But they fucking grabbed my camera, dude. Tried to take it out of my hand, both of them. And you saw, I tried to leave, I tried to move. They confronted me, I tried to avoid them. But it's the fucking police's job. It's the police's job to say something. They didn't even step in the middle. You know why? Because they don't fucking like me, that's the problem. Yo, let's share this, yo, for real. This is unacceptable.
man. <laughs> so this is car number seven. You ain't really, you can't really tell. Let's go. I need names and badge numbers. No, I'm fucking pressing charges. Your motherfuckers ain't leaving. I'm pressing charges, yo. Your motherfuckers ain't leaving. You understand? If you leave, that's fucking discrimination. You understand? Can I get your names and badge numbers right now? Fuck that. This is live too. Can I get your name, please? Steiner. Badge number? 38. Don't leave nowhere. Fuck that. We're not done. We're done, bro. Can I? All right. These motherfuckers is playing. Car number two. Name and badge number, please. 122. Oh, these motherfuckers. Can I get your name and badge numbers? Thomas Owen, number 18. Thomas Owen? Let me get the incident number to this. I want a fucking incident number to this. What motherfucker? Give me the inf incident number. What you mean? I'm not gonna fool you nothing. Because this didn't involve you. This involved. I have a right to fucking film the police. What do you mean? Listen, man. What do you mean? I'm not. I'm not arguing with you. So then, what the fuck? You're not doing your job either, bitch. I just did my job. Yeah, that's good. Turn your fucking body cam on. I mean, I mean, you didn't do shit. I want fucking charges pressed. You understand? Which what the you? fuck? Her fucking assault, motherfucker, harassment. Okay, yeah. They tried. They fucking physically touched me. And you physically touched them. I, what? You fucking stupid. You're fucking done. I physically touched them. I moved away from them. You motherfuckers is done. It's a wrap. Right. Give me a fucking incident number now. Listen, man. listen nothing. If you're gonna fucking take I, the report, I, then I listen. I want you to go down to the station. Fuck you. And file the Fuck you. We're doing it now. You gotta go. No. What's your name and badge number? Weeks ninety nine. No, we're not fucking done. Do your fucking job. Do your fucking job. You're done, yo. Lawsuit. Lawsuit, bitch.